So here's an interesting item that I picked up. Um, it's a, a small little enclosure with a power supply and an ISA backplane. Um, I have a PicoGus installed. Um, see, it also has, um, basically it has this one other interface card in it. And what that does is it connects to a, a PCMCA card that um, then allows you to bridge certain I.O. ranges and interrupts from your computer over to this enclosure uh, with the idea being that you could use you could use ISA cards on your um, on your laptop. So I thought, oh, you know, this would be a, a really neat way to um, test out the uh, uh, Gravis ultrasound uh, on a laptop. Um, but uh, I ended up I couldn't do it. Um, I knew these were uh, limited, like uh, it only supports 8-bit I.O. Uh, it does not support DMA. Um, you can only have one IRQ. But what I didn't realize was um, because of how they've wired it, you can only um, you only get one uh, I.O. window. So um, I can't do Gravis Ultrasound because it um, it obviously needs the the 240 range and then the 340 range, um, and you can't configure uh, can't configure that. So I have it set right now to do uh, 380 to 39 F, uh, and I'll just just for fun just show um, that it's uh, I've got the Pico Gus has. Um, it has the uh, AdLib uh, firmware on it, and so that's this is the uh, the PC 110's PCMCA uh, using the uh, Gravis ultrasound card, um, and uh, so I thought that was uh, that was fun. Um, it's not that practical. I have a a better version of this that I've I've been working on on and off and I will that's why I got this I just wanted to see if they had any kind of tricks that I could learn from and there was there's nothing I'm uh, well ahead of what this product can do so um, uh, nothing nothing to learn from it but it uh, it left me still wanting to do grab soldier sound on the laptop so it pushed me to finally um, Go ahead and finish um, bringing the uh, Gravis ultrasound code over um, onto the uh, onto the the uh, PCMC card. I've shown this many times now. Um, so if we just if we just fire this up, um, hopefully that did not uh, make a popping sound. Let me just turn this on. So yeah, I basically I have the I put the PS RAM on this with the anticipation that I would eventually um, implement uh, the PicoGus firmware for this, um, and I've I've since finally uh, gone ahead and and done that. So I'll just do a quick demonstration of that. I think this is the first time that there's been Gravis ultrasound on a on a laptop. I I think I'm not certain but uh i think so so this is just a, a small enabler i wrote that will enable the card and set it up in in gravis ultrasound mode and then um demo second and then we can do uh the second reality uh demo in gravis ultrasound mode and uh yeah that's it so I thought that was neat. So I'll just I'll let this play up play. Um, and uh, yeah, I'll have an update on the other stuff in the future. I'm just waiting on uh, a consignment of some parts for assembly of these boards. Um, and that's why in the meantime, while I'm waiting on some of that stuff, I'm playing with all these other things. So I'll let the demo play. And yeah, this is Gravis Ultrasound PCMCA card.